Professor Portman, what is your key message to the members of your special interest group called Business Informatics? The key message is that we here in Switzerland should rediscover the applied informatics for business cases but also for government and societal cases so that we create together academia, business, government and society create together systems that help each and every single member of this special interest group. Interesting. And what motivated you to initiate the special interest group? I had or I was member of another special interest group before, so I have some experience how to be involved there. To build up that, that's something that I'm doing with my colleague here, Professor Hans-Georg Phil at the University of Fribourg. And we came to the conclusion that in Switzerland or in the German-speaking part of Europe, we lack a bit the mentality of applying stuff, of building stuff, of doing, creating new information systems and we do not only want to observe how people deal with information systems but we also want to improve for a better society, maybe also for better democratic system, for better decision making. So we need to build our own information system with our own mentality, with our own Swissness in it and not just take them from Silicon Valley or elsewhere. What are the profits for special interest group members? The profits for special interest groups members is several meetings are planned for the next few months. Um, and so they will be involved into these meetings. They can discuss with us. They will see also exhibitions that we are planning. Um, they will discuss and be able to think about like where could we develop, create together new systems. Okay. And when can we expect the first event to take place and what topics will it contain? The topics are that we want to create or we want to do the first event with uh, business informatics topics all around like uh, network industry where I'm working a lot with network industries, Swiss Post for example, SBB or Swisscom. So they are providing so Swiss citizens a network and together with the network industry we are um, thinking of doing an exhibition uh, the 20th of May during the day when the Swiss Informatics Society is inviting people anyway. So we'll have there an exhibition where we show how we are working with the network industry to create new tools and we want to attract mainly also students there so that the students can discuss with us about like possibilities, future studies and how they can be involved in the process of new creating new information systems for Switzerland. Do you have a wake up call for possible members for joining your special interest group? I think my wake up call is that I think the time is now that we should work closer together in a transdisciplinary setting. What does that mean? I think we from computer science informatics departments should work with business that we understand business from a university side, but we should go cross boundary from the university also involving people from, in my case, network industry, but also other cases like banking or so, that we create together with the industry, with the government, with the society, create better system. And that is the wake up call. So you should join our special interest group if you would like to co-develop with us future information system for Switzerland for the benefit of Switzerland. That makes sense. And who should be joining your special interest group, Business Informatics, in particular? I think uh, everybody interested, of course, should join. The, it's open for everybody. We will be cross-disciplinary. We have in our teams also people from psychology, sociology, neuroscience. So we want to create together a future. So it's open to everybody, but I think most interesting will it be for academics, more applied academics that want to create system, engineers, uh, designers from creating information system perspective. And it will also be interesting, I guess, for people coming from government, for example, smart city government, or creating new services for Swiss population. So all of them are highly invited to join and to create uh, new ideas together in a co-working process. Professor Portman, thank you very much for this interesting interview. 
Thanks.